The Bidron Hydroelectric Power Station is a hydroelectric power plant located in the Swiss Alps in the canton of Valais in Switzerland. The power plant is fed with water from the Grand Dixence Dam's reservoir, Lac des Dix and is part of the Clearson Dixence complex. The 1,269 MW power plant is operated by Grand Dixons SA. Production began in 1998, with two world records set upon its completion the world's most powerful Pelton turbine, as well as the highest head used to produce hydroelectric energy. A penstock rupture in 2000 forced the closure of the power plant, and it was operational again in 2010. Topic: <laughs> Specifications. This facility houses three Pelton turbines, with each turbine rated at 423 MW approximately 567,000 HP. Note that the turbine acceptance testing process reported a maximum turbine output power of 449 MW each approximately 602,000 HP due to better than expected efficiency and ideal test conditions. At the rated power of 423 MW each turbine operates at a head of approximately 1,869 m 6 feet, and a a flow rate of 25 cubic meters per second, with an efficiency in excess of 92%, approximately 92.23%. The turbine assembly is a five-jet configuration. The stream of each jet is 184.7 millimeters, 7.2716535 inches in diameter, with an exit velocity of 191.5 meters per second, 628.28 feet per second. The kinetic energy of each of the five streams, i.e., one from each jet, is approximately 92. 16 megawatts q topic 5 cubic meters per second v 191.5 meters per second h equals 1869 meters the assembly rated pressure is 203.2 bars 2944 psi the combined flow rate for the three turbines is 75 cubic meters per second. The facility peak power production is approximately 1,269 megawatts. The turbines and associated valves were designed and developed by VA Tech of Switzerland. Topic: <laughs> Penstock rupture. On December 12, 2000, at approximately 2010, the clearson dixons penstock, feeding the Pelton turbines at Bidron, ruptured at approximately 1,234 meters AMSL under more than 1,000 meters of head. The failure appears to have been due to several factors including the poor strength of rock surrounding the penstock at the rupture location. The rupture was approximately 9 meters long by 60 centimeters wide. The flow rate through the rupture was likely well in excess of 150 cubic meters per second, 5300 cubic feet per second. The ensuing rapid release of a very large quantity of high pressure water destroyed approximately 100 hectares, 1 square kilometer of pastures, orchards, forest, as well as washing away several chalets and barns around Nendaz and Fay. 3 people were killed. The Bidron facility was inoperative after the accident. However, it became partially operational in December 2009 and fully operational in January 2010. Much investigation went into the accident resulting in the almost complete redesign of the penstock. Legal action is still in process and the root cause of the rupture is unknown. Topic: Redesign However details regarding the redesign are available. The redesign calls for improvements in the pipes lining as well as the addition of grouting around the penstock to reduce water flow between the penstock and the surrounding rock due to dynamic variation of the pipe diameter during operation it expands due to water loading during operation then contracts when the load is removed, leaving a gap. The damaged section of the penstock was rerouted around the previous location to where new undamaged, more stable rock is available. Construction on the redesigned penstock was completed in 2009. Redesign considerations include operational control of maximum agreed design limits under all conditions of assembly, design and service conditions including water hammer pressure spikes. Topic: See also Grand Dixence Dam List of hydroelectric power station failures